we going exactly? To original settlement. From early days. Before Kivan Group come. You mean the first mining colony is still here? Duh. Now abandoned. Mostly. Entirely restored. Uh. This is the place you broke into. Broke implies it took effort. Wait, this is the Continuum Cortex? It's the best, best way to reach Nova ship before moves again. You found Corel. Where is she? Nova ship currently in the Lydra system, orbiting Michael planet. Contraxia. Cosmo not surprised. Pesky raccoon enjoy garbage planet. Their restrooms do provide valuable information. Entire planet now broadcast same signal as Novorog. Cosmo not understand purpose or intention. Call them bars and bedding parlors and brothels. Maybe it's not such a bad thing after all. Cosmo pained to agree with Assassin. You were having a great time when... Stop. Now. Don't worry, Cosmo. We'll get to the bottom of this weird broadcast. Or die trying. No way, dude. I've got your back. I am Groot. Thanks, Groot. I know you do. How many people know about this place? Enough. It's not broadcast across galaxy, but scientists come from many backgrounds. If Thanos had known this was here... So, what is this? Like another elevator? They'll figure it out. Please to stand back, Guardian of Galaxies. Whoa! What magnificent witchcraft is this? I know. It's like they've never seen a giant transdimensional hand before. Please, to step in ball. What if things go sideways? How do we get back? With passport. Can communicate with Cosmo, and if emergency, bring Guardian of Galaxies back. I boot. Better you take it than Captain Valor over here. This time, investigate Nova ship. Use passport to report findings. And you'll speak to the world mind? Get rid of that fine, right? Cosmo do best. Good luck, Guardian of Galaxies. Anyone see any seatbelts? You better not throw up this time. This is... Sorcery? I was going to say dizzying. I am Groot. You get used to it. Are we in space? We're somewhere between space, between dimensions, between time, between realities even. What do you mean, between? We could theoretically go wherever and whenever with this thing. Even the places that don't exist, but uh, do. Incredible. Oh. Avengers! Assemble! <laughs> what kind of name is Avengers? Is that sound normal? <laughs> normal? You ain't heard nothing yet. Oh, Pat Benatar and Joan Jet watch over us. Who are these gods you speak of? Goddesses. <laughs> uh, Drax? <laughs> I am not the one laughing. It's obviously an ill omen of our impending deaths. No matter where you hide, I will fight. No. Or it's an alternate reality. <laughs> I know the sound. I am proud. Definitely an alternate reality. Is that Earth? Peter! Mom? Come on, you're deep for the promise here. Come on in, Janie. Peter will be up in a second. Really? Janie? Okay. Next stop, Alice Hope. Probably. Hold on, Groot. Here we go. <gasps> Flark and Alice! Oh, breath! Okay, here we go! Whoa! Oh, Flark! The correct. You guys okay? Do we look okay? Well, hang in there. I'll try to restore gravity. Oh, great. We're gonna be stuck like this forever. Rocket, buddy, what am I looking for? Drax, tell Scut Lord most ships use external power conduits to generate pseudo-gravity in hyperbaric airlocks. The Beast says to find a power conduit. Right, and what do those look like? 
tell him any vestiges of power should show up on his visor. And to stop asking so many flocking questions and get us down from here. Something terrible happened here. What gave it away? The lack of gravity or the general destruction? Both are undeniable clues. I'm not seeing anything useful. Somebody tell him I ain't gonna do all his work for him. Okay, I've got two conduits here. Someone tell him to turn them on. Thanks, buddy. Nothing's happening. Gamora, tell him to check the power supply. It's empty. Then tell him to find a battery. Did you catch that? Yeah, yeah. Rocket, what were you two doing in the Cortex? Coming back from a job. A successful one. Why come back to nowhere at all? I mean, if you really wanted to quit. The, uh, the, the client was there. Me and Groot had to get paid. Uh, someone tell him what he's looking for. Peter Quill, you are supposed to be looking for something. A battery! So we can get the lousy gravity going. Let him know his hand gave us the finger. You think insulting him will keep us out of jail? We have not yet completed the investigation. We should wait. Storm drain find a battery yet? We are still floating, so no. How'd you end up getting arrested, Rocket? We let him. Heard you three were in the clink, so we came to bust you out. That is an obvious lie. Peter, we need a battery to restore the gravity. Might be just what we need. Then pick it up already. All right, I'll have you guys on solid ground in a tick. Okay, got us a battery. Took him long enough. Hey, I'm trying, man. And we're still floating around. I am surprised that you were apprehended, Rodent. The deviousness is not often tested. They were waiting for us. We never had a chance to get away. Okay, I got the battery installed, Gamora, but nothing's happening. Seriously? Ugh, fine. I'll tell them. Listen up, slug breath. Tell me what you see. Uh, there's a blue wire and two connections, yellow and red. And one big green thing. Don't touch the green thing! Not a great time to start yelling, dude! Okay, okay. First, plug the wire to either connection. All we need is a little jump start. Either one? It's not brain surgery, just pick one. Uh, here goes nothing. Oh, crap! You touch the green thing, get it, you! Fucking great, well! Everybody, just hold on! Gravity was not restored. You had one job, Quill. I did exactly what. <sighs> Imp 
impressive, Peter Quill. I didn't know you could do that. Neither did I. Those firearms are becoming quite formidable. Second time they've transformed like that. Third. If that was the third time, when was the first? The day I was kidnapped. Should we call Cosmo? Let him know what he found so far? I am Groot. What do you mean, a code word? I am Groot. Fine. Groot won't call the mud until we all agree on a code word. Could be useful if we get cornered by whatever's on the ship. How about Quill Kill? Not covert enough. Must be something said in everyday conversation. Easy! We went on a dumb mission, and Quill killed us. Ooh, oh! The code word is Ride the Stars. And we should hold off calling Cosmo until we figure out what's going on. We should also standardize our use of the term dog report item to distinguish information of interest to our investigation. Yep. Sure thing, buddy. Dog report item. Something caused Nova Corps to abandon their ship. Maybe they all just quit. Some people don't give up when things start going wrong. Was that a crack? No, it was a pointed criticism. I am Groot. They're upset. How do you think I feel? Can we just focus on what happened here? I agree. The dog's investigation is our priority. And finding out what happened to Corral and Nikki. This is the only way out, but the door's got no juice. Must be on a different circuit. That'll do it. Why does that keep happening? There, you all felt that, right? Yep. The same thing happened when I tried to restore the gravity. It ain't never his fault, is it, Gru? Dast. Looks just like what happened on the rock. Indeed. It was a desperate attempt at a last defensive position. Good bottleneck for it. All the blaster scorch marks are from standard issue Nova rifles. If this was a fight, then where are all the bodies? Good point. There weren't any in the evacuation hangar either. Maybe everyone escaped. I wouldn't get your hopes up, Peter. Okay, we need to get to Corell's office. Someone tell Quill. Come on, dude. Can't we just talk to each other? Fine. You do know your girlfriend probably didn't make it. Now you are just being spiteful. Still nothing but emergency power. Dog report item. Power outage in several sections of the ship. What are we missing? Let's run through it all. We got arrested by your girlfriend. As did the churchman Grand Unifier Raker, and then his ship exploded. So maybe that's where it started. Raker might have had something on his ship. A gas, maybe? The explosion could have released it. I've used something like that before. Right. Pump it into the vents, and it spreads through the ship. I knew this would come in handy. Where'd you get a Nova passkey? Nikki gave it to me, to keep it away from her mom. We could sell that. It must be worth a couple thousand units. Do you know what Nova Corps does to people who steal from them? <laughs> Look around. How much you want to bet there aren't enough Nova left to execute us? What do you hope to find here, Peter Quill? Nikki had all kinds of secret passageways on the ship. Maybe she left a message or something. You are fond of this girl. I, I guess. I mean, we actually had a lot in common. Kind of reminded me of me, you know? I do not know. Uh, it doesn't matter. I just want to make sure her and her mom are okay.
Like a way to turn the power back on. Or some kind of hint to what happened. Yeah! Oh no. Please don't. Do you know this maintenance worker, Peter Quill? No. You seem relieved. I am. What the flark are you two doing? Let's go already! Now we're exploring maintenance tunnels. It can't hurt, can it? Better we check than miss something. This place don't look too safe is all. No way. Drax's rap sheet. He's got to see this. So what's the deal with Quill and that kid anyway? The cadet. I don't know. I thought he tried to save her just to impress Corel. What do you mean it worked? There's a tracker on my ship. I find it strange that this area is abandoned. Wish I knew the layout of this tub better. Then we could figure out where this started. You know where we are, Gamora? Not really. Anova never really let me out of their sight. They had good reason not to trust you. This again? I was only stating that Nova's position of not trusting you was accurate. At the time, you have since proved yourself a worthy ally. <laughs> the longer we bicker, the more we might miss. Very inspirational. Yeah, you get that off a placemat? All I'm saying is we're in this up to our necks, and we'll need to work together to get out of it. Dog report item. No sign of anyone so far. Didn't you add that one already? If I did, it is worth repeating. Stumbling around in the dark. Whoa, ho, ho. Oh, look at you, you sexy beast. Ah, uh, flirting rocket. Is it supposed to be upside down? Eh, uh, only if you wanted to channel all the ship's power up through the ceiling. Makes no sense to me. There must be a reason. A bad one. Try that console. Uh, we can use this to re invert the core, or uh, uh, de invert. Uh, de divert? Rocket. Ah, uh, the console's safety locked because the mounting arms are retracted. If we can pop them out of them side panels, we can flip the core. Well, stop flarking around. It ain't gonna work without the arms. It is time. Here it comes. For Peter Quill's mask to guide us with its mysterious power. Ain't nothing mysterious about it. There's gotta be more machinery up there. Gamora, give me a boost. Of course! Definitely something up here! Obviously! Hell yeah! It worked! You know, them guns would make better engineering tools than weapons. Nice try. Let's get the other one free. All right, Gamora, let's get the second one done. Okay. Gonna need a hand up again, right here. Let's do this. That did it. 
Get back down here! Now let's see what we can... Oh, Scott! We've got incoming! Yeah, it's more of them infected freaks! Man, I was hoping we'd find Novacore here, but not like this! Now we know who inverted the core! We'll just be added to our permanent records. Branch out, you! Peter Quill, I've got a help, good guy! Take me! Find a way up there and discover why, for the dog report. Rocket, what's that console telling you? That you should come do the honors. Okay. Kinda wondering why Cosmo didn't fetch a bunch of his muscle and do this himself. Just hit the button when you're ready, Quill. What does Hala's Hope do, anyways? Other than being a giant pain in the tail. It's a peacekeeping ship. Capable of extreme violence. That's the whole idea. A deterrent of how to prevent mediated conflict. Whoa! Surprise! This whole thing's a lift. We can ride it all the way up there. I guess Nova grunts and grease monkeys don't get the cool flying suits. Typical. Nobody respects their engineers. Whoa! Clark! Monkey clamps! They're shutting us down! More freaks approach! Lorker, he re-inverted the core again! We'll just have to re de re invert it back! After we take some head! No, they ain't cops, bro! They're freaks! Fancy 
Nazi pants do look for armor, I swear! So, let's take that Scritnex soldier out then! With pleasure! What happened? Did we trip the alarm? Yeah! I think we just stomped all over the element of surprise! Those protagonists mines walk off! What's the car? Less lethal? No hearts, I bet. I'm ready! Find me an opening! The sorcerer's buzzing wars are persistent! What's next, Peter? No, Gamora! I see it! Ha! Oh, good luck with those mines now! I bring strength oh. that's underutilized! All right, let's get those clamps off so we can keep moving. I will tear them from their sockets. Ain't gonna work, Musclehead. But this time, we've got a control room to play with. Looks like I can remove the clamps from here. Good. We will not be stopped by clamps. Ah, sneaky dast bags. They scrambled the power circuit, so I can't release them. I'm tired of these clamps. Gonna have to reroute the circuits one by one to reset the power grid. Here, I'll get the door for you. You should be able to see the grid with your visor. Okay, visor's up. Now what? Yeah, that's what I'm looking for. Everybody stay alert. Quill has a knack for pushing the wrong buttons or crossing the wrong wires. The small hairy one is insinuating you are bad luck. Funny how the small, hairy one is always right there guiding me. Peter Quill is insinuating that you, Weasel, could be the cause of our problems. Uh, hurry it up, Quill. Lumpy's bugging everybody with his color commentary. Looks like the wall's weak here. Gamora, can you pry this wall open? No, I just end up wrecking my blade. Drax, I need a hole here to reach the grid. Then you will have one. Smart to ever sign up with them scuttle. Maybe I can get up higher to see what's going on. Any ideas? Working on it. Groot, I think I have an idea. Use your roots to raise that platform with me on it. Kind of a root root boost thing. He's eager to try the root root boost. I am Groot. Neat trick. Did that do anything? I see it now. You've got half of it rerouted. Now work on the other room. Okay, I'm getting the hang of this. Might be gunning for your job soon. You want to trade? I'm happy to sit in the captain's seat. You frequently sit in the captain's seat. I did not just hear that! I am Groot. Groot's right. Maybe we should just call Cosmo, tell him we tried, and port the Flark out of here. It ain't our fault Scut was locked down. We will not fail at our mission. I mean, that sounds great and all, but we usually fail at our missions. Not this time. Our work here is important. Groot! Need your help, buddy! Root boost, please! I am Groot! Right about there. I am Groot! Okay, 
I bet I can reroute the power to get myself back out of here. Hell yeah! Who's smarter than Novacore? This would go a lot faster if we all had the ability to scan. Yeah, you got any uh, priceless lattice hex or navy and crystals lying around? I'll gladly build you one. Looks like you did it, Star Pants. Now get into the control room and hit that clamp release. I'll re reinforce the core at the same time and get us moving again. Well, I think you had it right the first time. So, is there any chance of Quill getting back together with Lady Law? <laughs> She's no lady. She never set her standards that low anyway. That's factually untrue. Oh, hey there. Anyone else feeling ready to move on? Yep, I can do it. Kinda wondering why Cosmo didn't fetch a bunch of his muscle and do this himself. Doors open, and I got the power flowing through. Almost qualified to be a junior engineer. Thanks. You know, normally, you're not supposed to travel through dimensions without a quarantine and a decompression on the other side. Should we be concerned? Just keep an eye out for the warning signs. The clamps are unclamped! Split! Now get back in here before we leave you behind. Yeah, let's see how far you get without your button pusher. Now that we know the infected Nova are here, we can agree that whatever's going on upstairs is really bad, right? They were furious when we removed their power source. It must be important to their effort here. Can't wait to smash it. Whatever it is. All right, this is our floor. These doors are sealed tight. Gamora, can you pry that thing open for us? And bend my sword? Nope. Drax, hit that panel where all the wires connect. <laughs> Step aside. Come out to the coast. We'll get together, have a few laughs. What's that? Oh, uh, nothing. No, that. They must have flipped the core back. Something's powering up again. Great. Now we're stuck in the ventilation. Great job, Quill. Dude, I know you're peeved, and I'm sorry. Apology accepted. Really? That's it? In case you hadn't noticed, there's more important things happening right now than Quill saying he's sorry. Larkin Scott! What are these Franklin Gaboons doing to Contraxia? What is this thing, Rocket? I don't know! Looks like it's siphoning something! Something to do with those cubes? No, no! I gotta get a closer look! Peter Quill, we have been in this hangar before! It's like they're stocking up on something! So what is it? I think they're using the ray to fill some kind of battery. Standard galactic I.O. ports. Regalian glass mat separators. Cree cathodes. I understood some of those words. I ain't never seen nothing like it. Energy readings are all over the place, but I can't tell what kind of energy it is. What the flark? Check out that giant ray thing! Can you get us across? Dog report item! We gotta destroy this thing! We don't even know what it is! Plus, we'd probably end up taking out the entire ship! And us with it! <laughs> oh! Let's avoid 
the scary beam! Good advice! Guardian of Galaxies, Cosmo check. Investigation lead him to believe Halo is key to Galaxy mystery. What is that noise? We are compiling an extensive dog report. Ah, flark the report! Tell him his magic hand almost got us killed! Cosmo not held responsible for continuum vortex right away. Pesky Raccoon should know this. There's trouble on the ship. Big, loud trouble. Give specifics. Novacor has gone bananas. There was a battle, but no bodies anywhere. Oh, and there's this giant frickin' ray gun. Have Guardian found Centurion Corel? Not yet. Guardian must find her. May have answers we need. Zero for whatever's happening. We gotta find Corral, get some real answers. You have any idea where she is? I'm thinking we check her office. I even know how we can get there. You know a way out of the hangar? Yeah, same way me and Nikki went last time we were here. You know, we never did talk about why you jumped after her, Peter. Uh, because it was the right thing to do. We should hurry. More zealots could arrive at any moment. Huh, that ain't right. Dog report item. Massive device siphoning energy from contraction. Don't forget the energy cubes. Dog report item. Energy stored in strange cubes. Rocket, can you see where that vent leads? Anything can get out of here. We should be prepared in case the beast tries to destroy it. There you go. I've done my part. Yeah, thanks. We may not stay damp forever. We still need a way to...
Dog report item. The rumbling Or contraxia. Nah, I tried shooting. The batteries are blasted through. Gotta find another way through. One of the batteries. Drax, gonna need you to drag this over. I will assume you have a plan. Perhaps the nearby machinery can help. Ah, I see what you are thinking, Peter Quill. Uh, right, just like I planned. Any ideas on what the oversized vacuum is actually doing, Contraxia? Just like I thought. Impressive work, Peter Quill. Just hope it does not cause an explosion. All right, come on, the tunnel's just past here. We got lucky no one else showed up. The Unifier has detected an intrusion. Spread out. It will be contained. By, by her, her will. will. Move! There's too many of them. In the hole! Jump! Still don't get why you jumped after the kid back then. Top ten dumbest things I ever saw you do. You should have seen how worried he was. Hey, Star Pants was our ticket with the captain. I was worried his death would lead to more jail time. It was adorable. I hate you all. I'm pretty sure this is right. Pretty sure? Everything was on fire last time. I couldn't make that happen. No, no. Rocket, no! It grumbles more incessantly than a Catapian without breakfast. Ain't that a piece of the Unifier's old ship? Unifier. Yeah, whatever. When we were arrested, they mentioned Raker got caught for the same thing we did. Not exactly the same. He got caught scavenging in the quarantine zone. How is that not the same? We were not scavenging for the same thing. Forget Raker. Our focus right now is finding Nikki. Your focus? My focus is not dying on this stupid ship. The dog wants us to find Centurion Corel. Right, so we're multitasking. I did not realize you and the girl fell down so far, Peter Quill. I didn't fall. I jumped. Heroically. Gamora, any chance you can help us here? I got this, Peter. One more time, Groot. Let's go find Corel and Nikki. So, we all agree that the captain and her kid are probably dead, right? Corel survived the worst of the war. And a relationship with Peter. Still willing to bet they didn't survive this. You'd wager on whether or not a mother and child are dead. What if only one is dead? You don't think this is slightly inappropriate given Peter's history? Not really, no. Nikki's one of the most resourceful kids I ever met. Be careful down there, Peter Quill. Yeah, definitely a lot sparkier than last time. Uh, make sure the kid ain't floating face up somewhere. What do you say, Gamora, now that the floor can't kill us? I say, no problem. Well, definitely no sign of Nikki or Corel. I mean, I guess that's good news. We should start thinking about exit plans. The exit plan is to call Cosmo after we get the answers we need. Answers you need, maybe. Don't suppose you've seen Nikki? I'm sorry, what? You feeling okay, Peter? It's one of Nikki's robots. She gives them names and takes care of them or whatever. It does not look taken care of to me. Does not strike me as very safe here, Peter Quill. Better this than getting shot at. Eh, speak for yourself. You'd rather get shot at? More fulfilling to shoot someone I don't like than look for someone I don't care about. Our leader seems to care, and so we should also pretend to care. I am <sighs> Of course you would.
Careful, Peter Quill. Okay, don't remember this green gas being here last time. I think you mean deadly green gas. This whole ship's a death trap now. I'm sure there's a way to unburst these pipes. There better be, because there's no way I'm walking through that. Easy. Okay, that was bad, even for you. Ah, more death caps. Maybe Nikki and Corral are using it to protect themselves. Or, and hear me out on this, maybe they're dead. You know what, man? You're being a real jackass, like, way more than usual. Tension is palpable. Oh, can you both please just get over this? Agreed. Either resolve your issues or fight to the death. Hey, I ain't the one who keeps sabotaging this team. You're the one who quit! Out of frustration with Will's lack of fleeting-like qualities. All I know is I'm not the one who quit the team. I quit because I care. I care too, man, okay? So maybe we both just have shitty ways of showing we care. Really shitty. Yeah, maybe. Dog report item. The rumbling continues. Poor Contraxia. Gamora, could you, uh... Glad to help. <laughs> You sure this is the right way? Just keep your eyes open. You know, Peter, if Nikki and Corel really are... They're not. I'm just saying we should be ready for anything. They're not. Are you sure this is the right way, Peter Quill? It's clearly not. I'm investigating. No, nothing dog report worthy. And still no signs of Nikki or Corral. In the face of death's infinite mystery, Tapios are taught to focus on what is tangible. I'll keep that in mind. Here! This is definitely the right way. Nikki's secret hideout is just through here. Thought we were going to the captain's office. We are. Right after we check here. Try not to break anything. This place means a lot to her. Oh, wow. Didn't Nikki paint all this? Pretty cool, right? Nikki! Little one, reveal yourself! Maybe try being a little less scary. It's Peter! The... the, the pirate? Nikki! We do not intend to kill you. We need to get into that room. Rocket, you got the body of a little girl. Can you fit in there? Try again, Quill. Ask him nicely, Peter. Two for two! Thank you, Nikki's passkey. <sighs> Careful, Peter Quill. 
In my experience, children often booby-trap their toys. It's not Nikki's, it's mine. So we're just claiming her stuff now? Because if we are... No, I mean it literally used to belong to me. Uh, Quill, you gotta see this. This kid's obsessed with you. Wait, why does she have your toy? It's just something I gave to Corral when we were together during the war, like a keepsake. It doesn't mean anything. Does, uh, this mean anything? How old is the child? Twelve. Ha! Congratulations, Peter Quill! You will make a terrible father. Unless the child is dead, in which case, it does not matter. W wait is this why you dragged us here? Clearly. The child is twelve, and Quill was with the child's mother twelve years ago. The math is irrefutable. Did you know? I just figured you did and didn't want to tell us. His bewildered silence. Yes, okay. So the dates maybe kind of match up, so it's possible, I guess. It's not like they had a health class on this. Inspiring. Can we just focus on if Corell and Nikki are okay? They're clearly not here, so let's move on and keep looking. 